Hey everybody, this is Ben and welcome to a new episode of Kerbal Space Program. Today, I am actually going to be, uh, for the time being, putting on hold my remote tech and cathane uh, playthrough that I was doing. Uh, hopefully just briefly, till those get updated, but you can see I'm on version 0 0.22. Which of course, means that I'm going to start a new game in career mode. Oh yes, oh I did not, I still need to think of a, a different flag to get. Whoa, trippy. That's a new one. Let's just pick... Uh, let's go with the rings. Why not? And player name... Can I keep my same name? I don't know. I don't know how these... So in career mode, you have to manage all aspects of your space program. Note, this mode is still under development. Yes, I'm aware. All right, so. Okay, no, I don't want to overwrite. Sorry. Player name. Career, sure. Oh, pick that flag. And so here we are, dropped in the new space center. Oh, check out the spaciness. Look at this place is, this place is looking great. Man, okay, let's go check out the R&D center, nothing selected. So, start the technology we started out with. So we get a command pod, we get LVT-30, we get rock solid boosters, a small fuel tank, a tiny girder, an antenna and a parachute. All right. What's this? Requires start. Science. Oh, five science. Okay, there we go. <laughs> um. Okay, interesting. So let's uh, let's build a rocket. I'm not sure. Oh, look at this. This is like. No choice is left to be made. <laughs> Propulsion. Um, let's see here. Well, actually, first, uh, put the engine there. Oh, I don't have. Uh, I need a parachute. Let's throw that on there. And oh, science. Oh yes, the, the sub-assembly, I forgot all about that. They added sub-assembly uh, saving and loading in this version. So happy that that's uh, stock now. Um, antenna. So let's, oh that's a, it's kind of, oops, excuse me. It's kind of a weird fit between the capsule and that fuel tank there. But that's okay. Um, so yeah, I actually, I don't have a decoupler. <laughs> um, so what I'm going to do, wow, I, I need some science, I guess. That's, that's what it comes down to. I need, I need more science. <laughs> I don't even have a single aerodynamic. I have no, nothing, nothing at all. Solid boosters, liquid fuel tanks. Um, hey, let's see if I can bolt some of these on. Why not? Um, whoa, okay, yeah, let's do that. And come on, come on, no. No, no chance. <laughs> um, come on, go. Yes, that's it. Great. Those and no.
Let's try that. No. Okay, I guess maybe that's too close. Um, well, let's just, let's go for it. Let's just make a tiny rocket. Um, yeah, and we'll try to get some science. Um, I honestly don't know how... <laughs> how the science is supposed to work. Um, I, I have not watched, um, very much of anybody playing this. I watched, uh, Scott Manley do a really quick, um playthrough of his trying to get like massive amounts of science in a single flight um hopper one sounds good save this sucker and let's let's fly it i mean i guess this is this is like rudimentary space program but whatever oh let's uh crew who do we got jeb I mean, really, who 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 but Jeb should be go the first one going up, right? Yeah. All right, so let's launch it. <laughs> okay, here we are, a tiny little rocket. Jebediah here on the launch pad. Um, so how do I, let's see here, transmit data, okay, great, um, crew report, transmit data, 100% science value, data size is 5 mits, okay, let's, uh, Extend, extend. Do I need these antennas? Maybe I don't even need these with the command pod. So let's transmit. 1.5 science added. Nice. So what if I, I'm, I'm basing this on, hey, I had you extended. Status is locked. Okay. All right, there we go. Um, so what if I do EVA? Don't let go. Don't let go. So I can do EVA report. This is the most precarious situation. <laughs> Discard, keep, transmit. Sure, we'll keep it. And we'll get back in. Review stored data. Cool. Oh, lots of science in that EVA stuff. Wow. Let's let's just keep it. All right, cool. So we've got throttled up. We've got SAS turned on. We've oh, we got a single stage with everything in it. <laughs> um. Let's not do it that way. All right. Well, lift off in three, two, one. We're just going to do kind of a straight up, straight down, I guess. I say do a crew report. The shores look inviting. And you watch the waves roll on the coast. Hey, transmits 100%, right? Nice. Oh, that electric charge just drops when you transmit the... Wow! All right. So, I mean, I have no stages. I have, I have no nothing. <laughs> Let's uh, let's try to land over the ocean. Wow, we are getting quite a bit of speed going here. This tiny rocket's ridiculously efficient. Okay, that is. Let's see how I did. 30, 30 kilometers. Dang. This was a powerful little sucker. Let's take a crew report. Yeah, let's just keep doing that. Keep sending the science back home. Um, I don't think I dare to EVA Jeb. <laughs> I mean, that would be a very Jeb thing to do at this point. <laughs> but uh, I do want him to live. 
So, I mean, we're going to... Ooh, a little bit far. There we go. This one antenna keeps ducking back in. All right, so that's that's our height. So, crew report. Kerbin's upper atmosphere. Yeah, not, not too much science for that one, but hey, I why not? Uh-oh, not enough electric charge. Ooh. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pop the chute before I <laughs> run out of control <laughs> electric charge, just in case. Um, yeah, I forgot all about that. Need some solar panels or those little... Uh, Radioisotope decay generators. What what you call them? Wow! Oh, there it shoots out. Shoot deployed. And we are still picking up speed though on the way back down. We're we got surprisingly high. Nice. Jeb is so happy. This is, he's waited his entire life for this moment. Kerbals taking their first steps out into the stars. All right, we're slowing down. Looking good. I'll turn off the SAS. I should have thought of that earlier. That drains power. Hmm, so crew report. Um, I think I just kind of got to I'm going to discard that. Uh, I'll rename vessel control from here. Operational toggle torque. Oh, that would save some uh, power as well. Wow. Okay, we'll do crew report. Crew's assessment of the situation. Eh. Fine, we'll keep it. Whatever. Do, do, do. Oh, review report. Okay, there we go. That's how you do it. Yeah, we're going to keep that. That's fine. Can you try to. These things all consume electricity? Because if that's the case. Oh. Aborting transmission. Okay. I see. Okay, so I really only need one of those antennas. That's that's all right. That it looked cool. And 10 meters a second looks good. Should have no problem. Plenty of plenty of engine below the pod <laughs> to absorb this impact. And hey, Jebediah is back on the surface. So let's, I believe there's, yeah, there's a new hidden recover vessel option hiding way up here at the top. So let's go ahead and recover. And here we go, look at this. Three experiments recover, crew report while flying over Kerbin's water. EV airport were flying over Kerbin's shores. The recover of a vessel that survived a flight. Five. So look at that. We got 23 science. I absolutely, um, yeah, I know we're going to need this. So we got better fuel tank. A couple of fuel tanks. We get this mystery goo containment unit. Um, strange looking substance. Watching how the goo behaves when subjected to different situations could be very educational. So we're just finding this random, <laughs> this random pod filled with goo and then watching how the goo reacts to different stuff. Oh yes, a decoupler. Let's go ahead and research that. Um, what's this parachutes? We get a new engine. How much science? I have 18 science. Okay, so I can get an engine, landing struts, and a different parachute or bigger engine, Separatron, bigger booster. But I still have radial decouplers, so the booster is not that much help in my opinion. Um, let me back eye, well. Mm, basic rocketry stability. So, 
I... Hmm. Decision? What's this one, anyway? Um, oh, there's the radial decoupler. Yeah, okay, and that's that's 18. I have exactly enough. Winglets, aerodynamic nose cones, radial decouplers. I think I've definitely got to go for that. Because I... What did I just get? I didn't get another engine there. Uh, another engine would be nice. But I'm I'm going with this. I'm going with this. The uh, and then oh great yeah it's the construction stuff. Look at that struts are way over here. Who forty five science for all this? Yikes. Ah. Oh. oh I need. I can't even research this. I need general rocketry over here. Jeez, we're so far from that. Stack tricoupler, and we've got flight control. Oh, pro bodies, excellent. Reaction wheel, winglets, cockpit, great. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap that up for my first episode of my Kerbal career. Thanks everybody for watching, and definitely join me uh, again next episode. I'll be continuing this, trying to collect some more science from the Kerbal system.